Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a great start to your Labor Day weekend. I have Monday off, so I'm excited for the long weekend. And it's also mine and Chris's second wedding anniversary on Monday. So I've actually already shot this video once, but it didn't quite work out. I'm super mad too because I really liked how my hair looked and my eye makeup. I've been browsing YouTube a lot lately and I wanted a new work bag. And then I saw that someone was using their Speedy 30 as a work bag and I was like, oh, okay. I want to do that but everything that's in here should fit in here if you have any questions about my lashes i am wearing flutter habit lashes this style is called the wink so as you can tell by this video this is all about purse organization but when i shot this video originally i had used a smaller purse organizer i think it was a size medium it fit in here but it made my purse feel really tiny and this speedy 30 is pretty big and you can actually fit a lot in here even if it doesn't really look like it so i felt like an idiot because i actually tried my black purse organizer size large from amazon that i use in my tory birch tote bag for work and it fit perfectly so i don't know why i didn't initially just try stuffing it in there but i was like no my purse is so delicate and actually it's really quite durable so i returned that medium purse organizer and got a large instead i wanted to get red so that it could match the interior of my speedy so basically it's not really a what's in my purse video this is more going to be a uh, let's stuff my purse let's pack my purse and right now i've got a ton of stuff in here that I really don't need like a dog seat belt because I actually cleaned the desk right here to my right got rid of a lot of junk that I really didn't need and then found some things that I thought I should just bring to my work office like a bunch of pens and this is a little like safety stabber thing um so we are just going to take all the excess out of this real quick I have a mirror. I actually want to put this in my car. It's good to have a little mirror in your car besides your sun visor mirror. I've also got some notepads that I don't need here because I only use these at work. Got a giant, giant paper clips. Um, I think those are all the excess items that I can easily get. Okay. Oh, and I've got a little coin pouch I want to keep in my car in case I ever need to pay for parking with coins. I actually really like this frame setup I have right now for um, this video. I might just do this more. That way I can sit in this chair and not sit on the floor. I don't know why I didn't think of this earlier. So let's pull this out. Actually, this might be too full. See, this is where I don't want to destroy my Speedy. I got this in college. Okay, so here is the original ooh, purse organizer that I've talked about so many times here on YouTube. It is so functional and it is so great to have in a tote bag or in a speedy. It really gives everything a home. So I've modified it so that it is my condensed work bag, but I really wanted to have the red interior, right? So I'm going to take everything that's in this and transfer it to my red purse organizer. The pocket situation is a bit different and there's just more opportunity for further organization in this one. So here's a quick look inside my purse. Um, this doesn't include my AirPods, which are normally in here, and my essentials pouch, which is normally in here as well. Anything fall out here? Just my, oh look, I have a gel X nail that I thought I was gonna put on, but then I changed my mind, so we're gonna get rid of that. And then this um, toiletry pouch. All right, purse is officially empty. Here is my new purse organizer, completely free of corgi hair. Oh, I need scissors. The tag here, let me cut this out. So here is the new purse organizer, also from Amazon. You can see there are pockets 
on the sides right here which would be nice for a pen or something like there is a specific pen holder like right here on this side so there is just more there's just more pockets overall but what my favorite part about these purse organizers is the little pocket on the side which is kind of where i throw all the things that i feel like could damage my louis vuitton wallet so overall it is quite similar to this version but this also came with a separate insert that i felt like i just had absolutely no need for so i never actually used it uh, whereas this doesn't just because it has more pockets so i just feel like this is just overall better but i am going to link both in the description box that way you can take your pick don't fall for the reviews large a large purse organizer will fit perfectly in a speedy 30. let's just go ahead and put it in this bag officially in there no struggle at all and I love that it is red so now all I see is red in here and it's just beautiful I am just pushing in the corners because right now <laughs> whereas with this purse organizer you can see these sides are being pushed out when I just put the red one in because it's so fresh and so new it's just so crisp it was folding in like this so there was like a it was kind of folding in like that so I just pushed it out and right now it is stained like so. All right, there you go. So let's go ahead and stuff my purse. Also outfit is from Amazon. Even this tube top is from Amazon. I don't know what this stain here is from, but don't worry, we'll take care of that. Okay, so here is the organizer layout and the side pocket, the big side pocket right over there. So let's go ahead, stuff this thing. Okay, my old purse organizer is right over here. So I'm going to grab my hand sanitizer. I'm gonna put that in one of these pockets. Maybe this one, there we go. And also I can still, if I need, reach into this pocket, the actual pocket of my Speedy. So that's great, it's not being covered, that's awesome. My work office keys in that little side pocket. I've got lip balm from NARS. This is one of my favorite lip balms because it gives you a nice little tint. So that color, I'm gonna drop it in here where my work keys are at. Chanel lip balm, no color here, but very moisturizing. I've got a makeup remover wipe because I went and did yoga after work. So I packed two just in case. I'm just gonna drop it in that same pocket my wallet you can see there's been some damage here but that's okay we will just stuff that mm. oh a hair tie is already in here i'm going to drop that in this side pocket put my wallet right over here so you can see oops sunglasses case they're not in here i should probably just put them in these are my newest Ray-Bans. They have like an inverted um, lens. I really like these. I like the blue tint. So I'm just gonna put that in here. Pepper spray. Doesn't expire till 2025, so we're good. I will put this probably in this pocket, but I also want to hide this chain so it doesn't scratch anything in my purse. So I'm just going to tuck that in. There we go. This lavender vanilla lotion I got from Bath & Body Works smells so good. It deserves its own pocket. There we go. I've got my essentials pouch. I'm gonna drop that in the middle pocket. Even though this is small and it's technically not really heavy, it can add a ton of weight to my bag. But it's, it's nothing crazy. Like it, it makes no difference in a tote bag just in a small bag like this. I'm going to flip this around so that this isn't facing my wallet. There's that. Um, my AirPods, will they get their own pocket? I guess I could put that in here. I do wanna keep a pen in there, but do I wanna keep blue? Thought I had a pink one. I guess I, oh, here it is. So these are my new pens from Amazon. I'm going to actually keep two in my purse. I'm gonna keep this blue one in my side pocket and I'm gonna keep this 
in this middle pocket right here. It's perfect for a pen. There we go. What else? My toiletry pouch. I always need this in a purse. I think every woman has one. Um, Maybe we'll put it here. There we go. It's my basic purse set up. I love it and I just the fact that I can see the original purse color when I look into my purse now is so nice. I know it's like the smallest thing, but it just makes me happy. So now this is empty and I'm going to put this back into my Tory Burch tote bag. I am going to clean this up because this corgi hair is ridiculous. I don't know if you can see, but oh, it is just, it is just not a good look. The other thing I want to mention is that I do bring my Louis Vuitton planner in to work with me. I like a paper calendar, but I have so many different calendars. I have my content planning calendar, which is digital. I have my appointment and vacation calendar, which is here. And then I have my work calendar for work meetings, digital. So everything's kind of all over the place. That's fine, that's fine. And so when I do pack this for work, I pack it on the opposite side where my toiletry pouch is not. And then I will carry it like this because what I do is I go into work, I take this out every day and place it there. So when I go home for lunch, I'm just carrying this. And then at the end of the day, I put it back in there and then I just, I carry it like this because this is not a speedy B. It's not a speedy bandolier. Um, and so the straps I have would only carry the weight by the two corners, which is not the best. So I am very careful with that. I also recently found a new purse strap that would match really well with this. And it is not this wide one, even though I know it's very in now. I've had this for years. It's one of my top selling, actually the best top selling item for my Amazon storefront. Um, but it's more of a, a leather type of strap. So it's thinner. I might get it just, just for something different, something new. I still have quite a few pockets available. So if I do need to add anything small to my purse, I can easily do that. But for now, this is my purse setup. It is easy to access. And that was the biggest difference I noticed with the medium size purse uh, organizer was that everything was just so much more compact and it was harder for me to get into certain pockets and just reach everything that I needed. Whereas with the large size, everything is visible and I can easily grab everything. So when that kept happening to me, that's when I realized I made a mistake. So now everything I took out that doesn't actually belong in my purse, but needs to be at my work office or in my car is just going to be tossed back in. Um, my coin pouch that I want to stay in my car. All of these extra pens. A doggy seatbelt. I only have one. I thought I had two, but I'm glad I found this because I know I just need to get one, but I feel like they come in a set. So I want to keep that in my car. And then I should probably just keep this in my purse and I have just the pocket for it. So that's good. And we're set. All right. So that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you found it helpful. If you are not already, please subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate it. And everything I mentioned is going to be linked in the description box. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave them down in the comment box. Otherwise I will see you in the next video. Bye.